USD CAD. <clears throat> the USD CAD did not really go as I expected. However, um, if I'm not mistaken, in the video I also mentioned that this support level is gonna be retested, and we can expect for the market to go up a little bit to hit this previous support level. I don't know. I believe I said that. If not, please don't attack me. I just assuming that I said that because it's really obvious. However, um, this is this is what actually happened. But now we cannot give any sell signal for the USD CAD because if I'm not mistaken, the whole or the the general direction for the USD CAD is gonna go for the bullish, meaning it's gonna go up. Therefore, we need to give the buy signal for the USD CAD, and let me just make it more simple for you. So, uh, we have here the let, oh, before that, I want to show you something that the reversal happened right here. If we um, draw a Fibonacci retracement, I just want to show you that the reversal happened exactly or almost let me just show you like like that so we can see that the reversal happened on Fibonacci 61.8 I uh, should have used that for my signal however um, we can expect now let's see let me tell you what we can what, what we can expect right now so we can see that in the end the uh, USD CAD closed Friday night in this uh, doji candle and the market right now seems to be going in reversal mode uh, the market is unable to break out from this uh, previous support level therefore so far it's gonna reverse and if I'm not mistaken on Monday opening the USD CAD is gonna fall down to this support level and then at this support we can start buying the USD CAD and keep the trade running all the way until it hit this previous resistance right here uh, let me just confirm it using a trend lines uh, it's always good to use the trend lines just to confirm our trade and since we are looking for the buy order I'm going to duplicate a support trend line just like that perfect we can see it it almost already happened we can see the reversal happened almost right here therefore we can expect for another attempt and the market will fall down and notice that if the market will hit this previous resistance trend line it is the almost almost the very same level of the previous support level and therefore this is where we, we can start buying the USD CAD so let me just try to make it short for you USD CAD should be good for the buy exactly look at that check it out like that so this level is matching with the support previous support level and also it's matching with the trend line I honestly think this is what will gonna happen this seems to be a very valid signal for the USD CAD however don't do anything until the market actually reverse again check it out perfect we already have a support number one and support number two on the four hour chart however we cannot yet uh, start buying the USD CAD all I'm saying is it is gonna go up we just want to wait for the right moment to start buying the USD CAD and just to be sure everyone is gonna be safe we can start buy the USD CAD on the level 1.30261 that's actually better level to start buying the USD CAD if you buy the USD CAD immediately um, you can expect to lose about 25 pips and that is of course assuming that the Monday opening price will be the same it might be a little higher or uh, lower we are not sure however in general uh, the USD CAD is good for the buy and uh, I highly recommend you to wait for the market to go down to reverse and uh, retest this broken support level and buy on the level 1.30261 and I believe that's enough for the USD CAD and I, uh, I would like to thank you for watching